Okay, let me go over what happened here. I was uh, on my way up to a photo shoot up the Monitor Pass, and I'm just going to shoot the fall colors, the trees, and whatnot. And you know, I got my pictures of the trees here and the waterfalls. And So I went off-road to the uh, fire lookout, which is at the 9,000 foot level up on top of a mountain. It provides 360 degree views and it's just a beautiful day. I had, uh, uh, I was really getting some great pictures. I was excited about it and then I wanted to do an artistic thing where I kind of spin around and uh, uh, overlay it uh, with a picture. And it, it look, it's supposed to look sort of something like this. <laughs> So nice. It's great. Round and round. What comes around goes around. I'll tell you why. Oh man, beautiful up here. Ooh -wee. That's so nice. It's great. Woo! Man. Ooh-wee. Whoa. As soon as I hit, everything went black. I, uh, I, do, I groped around for the camera and my hat and my glasses and, and, and sort of crawled off to the car. I couldn't see anything. And then shortly after that, uh, my vision came on, but it was, everything was super bright white. I, I really couldn't see anything again. It was, everything was just bright, like staring into the sun. I could just barely make out edge uh, images of like the car. So I, I took my shirt off and uh, used that as a compress to stop the bleeding. I was bleeding like a stuffed pig and uh, threw everything in the car. I knew I had to get out of there and couldn't see. I just started, hopped in the car and drove off at you know half a mile an hour just hoping I wouldn't go off the road. And it finally got so bad I knew there was a turn there and I couldn't see the turn. So I got out of the car to go walk the turn to find it. And while I was out walking, I uh, fortunately my vision came back. I went back to the car, hopped in, and uh, was able to drive out. On my way out, I was able to snap a couple of shots of uh, of my head here. And a few, uh... oh shit, man, it hurts. It hurts.